వసుదేవ సుతం దేవం కంస చాణూరమర్దనం దేవకీ పరమానందం కృష్ణం వందే జగద్గురు వై వాస్ కృష్ణ ఐ ఫ్లూటెస్ట్ బికాస్ హీ వాంటెడ్ టు పిరీస్ త్రూ అన్ ఆచార్య నాట్ డైరెక్ట్లీ ఇఫ్ యూ హ్యాడ్ బీన్ అ వోకలిస్ట్ దెన్ దట్ వుడ్ హీన్ ఎ డైరెక్ట్ ప్రీచింగ్ ఇఫ్ యూ హ్యాస్ ఇఫ్ ఎ సిన్స్ యూ అస్ అ ఫ్లూటెస్ట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ త్రూ ద ఫ్లూట్ త్రూ ది ఆచార్య దట్ హీ అడ్వైజెస్ అస్ దిస్ ఇస్ వన్ దెన్ వై చూస్ అ ఫ్లూట్ వై నాట్ వీణా ఫ్లూట్ హ్యాడ్ హోల్స్ a uh, uh, wind blows through the holes whichever hole the wind escapes that is the swarasthana shadja rishabha gandhara nishadha every swarasthana is caused when wind escapes through that particular hole because the swarasthana is different that doesn't mean the wind is different i can't get one wind for each hole there is no one wind for each swarasthana wind is the same but as per depending on the hole the sthana differs similarly atma is the same depending on the body he assumes he behaves differently once he sheds this body he will identify that the atman are similar they are all equal they are a part of brahmam and they reach vaikuntham and soshnute sarvan kaman sah brahmana vipaschita this was the message krishna gave as a flutist let us leave alone this difficult message now it is too logical let's not worry about that let us get into the experience part of it he says tad vrajastriya aashrutya venugitam smarodayam tad varnayitum aarabdha smarantya krishna chettitam barha peedam natavaravapu karnayoho karnikaram bibhradvasaha kanaka kapisham vaijayantincha malam randran veno radhara sudhaya purayan gopavrundaihi brindaranyam swapada ramanam pravishat geeta kirti before bhagavan krishna started to play flute there were many other flute vidwans but after he started playing all people resigned there were no more vidwans this is what is kimu kipi before krishna after krishna before krishna bk after krishna ak before krishna nandagopala one he was a great flutist before krishna menaka rambha urvashi they were great dancers before krishna even narada was a great veena player whereas after krishna all resigned because they were quite ashamed there should not be a patrika here after that there are 10 vidwans who will play first shri krishna would do second narada would do third menaka fourth rambha the other nine were quite ashamed can a patrika hold krishna name in the first and have our name in the next it cannot happen let the patrika read like this shri krishna the first player shri krishna the second shri krishna the third shri krishna the fourth navalam periya divinil nangamir idor apudam kelir navalam periya div the central jambu dvipa navalam periya divinil idor apudam kelir we all know of seven wonders of this world the old seven wonders and the new seven wonders there are two now old seven wonders new seven wonders there is an eighth wonder the eighth wonder is krishna playing his flute navalam periya tivinil nangamir idor arpudam kelir why is it an arpudam karavayin kanangal kal parappi ittu kavin dirangi shavi atta illave menagayodu tilottamai arangai urupasi avar velli mayangi mayangi vanaham padiyil vai therappinri aadal paadal avai marinar dhame when krishna started playing his flute and he chose a place he decorated himself he invited guests he invited the girls to listen to him he invited the cuckoo birds he invited the peacocks all the deers that were grazing he krishna invited and he sits on a lower branch of a tree he keeps his feet on yamuna sitting on a lower branch starts to play his flute there are many visitors they are all listeners they had rapt attention to krishna when krishna started playing flute all the ramba tilottama urashi menaka in the heavens they stopped dancing they froze and they, they started looking at krishna here after we will not play we will not sing we will not dance not only menaka tilottama there was a deer which was grazing and with that half at grass in its mouth came close to krishna and stood it, it, it was frozen the frozen looks what have you seen in uh, in movies there will be some moment something undue would have happened immediately it will freeze they all stop 
after two three minutes when we have regained it will all start moving have you not seen that when krishna started playing everything stopped they became still and they had to regain their conscience before they started moving again menaka stopped tirottama stopped chandra stopped surya stopped no one moved from vrindavana not only that yerudhi chittirangal pola the deer all the cows that the grazing they all were still like a painted picture the cows stood and the cows were taller than krishna so they spread their legs they bowed down and without moving their ears kept listening to the beautiful sound of krishna's flute why did they not move their ears krishna's flute gana the ganam was like amrita so they have had amrita through their ears not amrita through our mouth through our mouth amrita is known but this is gana amrita so they had gana amrita through their ears the cows were ignorant they thought if we move our ears if this gana amrita pours out what to do so let us not allow it to pour out let us retain gana amrita inside ourselves so they did not even move yedi chittirangal pola shavi atta gillave chitra kalpa shravasi kalayan langali karnapuram valankadil mel thonri poovanind kovalar sirumiyar yengum kavalum kadand kayiru malayagi nindrare to play flute krishna decorated himself he was quite uh, fond of only uh, natural decoration that is all products made from nature either pushpa or kundumani whatever are forest products he was quite happy with those products and he alwar says that this is vedanta deshika spasha chitra kalpa shravasi kalayan alwar says valankadil mel thunri poovanind he was to wear a kundala which was in his lower lobe but in his upper lobe he had also made a hole there and used to wear mel thonri poovanind one pushpam a particular variety of a forest flower he used to wear that any nagarikam any modernity is not modern at all that was quite old for krishna only difference is it looks good on him not good on us so kalahayita kuntalam kalapaihi karanonmadak vibhramam mahome dhanyasma moodhamatayopi harinna yeta ya nanda nandana mupatta vichitra vesham the bamboo stick bamboo trees and creepers were quite quite proud they thought this opportunity of touching the lips of krishna is blessed only to us not to a banyan tree not to a panamaram not to any other tree it is only the blessing to a bamboo tree because flute is made of bamboo is known as venu 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 is bamboo tree venu ganam is flute ganam so bamboo trees were very very proud but the other trees fell feeling very rejected they thought why is bhagavan so partial can he not see that during rama avatara he will hold a banyan tree during varaha avatara he will hold a palmyra tree during uh, uh, narasimha avatara he will hold a ashoka tree he never does that rama avatara he had in his hand a big bow made of bamboo again in krishna avatara used a flute made of bamboo so there is something problem with this bamboo and bhagavan what is happening there has to be some bribing this bamboo tree has bribed krishna rama so that he uses us only that and all the kavingas all the poets they whenever they talk about krishna's or rama's eyes they draw simile only from a lotus eye they all talk about a lotus eye why not alli eye why not malli eye why not jati eye they talk it's only padma pundari kaksha kamala kannan tamare kannan because there is some trade between tamare lotus and krishna krishna paid valmiki rama paid valmiki krishna paid because whatever he does they praise whatever we do they abuse o oh, you are our if it is our it's wrong if we think we even belong to him it's all right see there is a difference if we do something good something is good we do that we are termed to be good but in the case of krishna if he does something he need not know whatever is good if he does something that something is termed as good but for me if i do whatever is good i am termed as good this is the difference between krishna and me there is no need that he has to do whatever is good whatever he does becomes good because he is good whatever i do will not become good i will become good if i do whatever is good 
that's why you, oh, all this valmiki or maharishi all the bharadvajas they sing in praise of him dhanyaspa mudamataya nan akarnya venu ranitam venu ranitam sah krishna sarah so we complete bhagavan playing the flute marundu mankanangal meihai marandu meinda pullum kadaivai valishora irandu paadum tulunga pudai peyara yedhi chitrangal pola nindranave let us move on to the next next was chira harana leela and then yagya patnishu anugraha bhagavan blessing the wives of many many rishis and munis what happened one fine morning they had forgotten to carry lunch it was 12 in the noon bhagavan krishna was quite hungry all the boys were also hungry they saw some smoke coming out of some huts and they identified these must be rishis who are performing penances they are offering oblations so they must certainly have food they must have prepared food for their consumption and for offerings ho oh boys go to them plead that we are all quite hungry tell them that krishna is waiting with a hungry stomach yes they all went but those brahmanas never identified they were really fools they thought they are doing this penance to reach krishna krishna has come down to them asking for food but they decided we cannot give him before doing the penance so these boys were quite wild once if you are hungry and you are not given you feel very very dejected so they came running to krishna started crying they were fuming krishna said once you have decided to beg don't have respect at all don't worry if you don't you are not fed here go to the next house you must have the patience to knock at doors you don't lose your patience go to their wives request them to feed you let us see what they do all the boys went to their wives and wives realized the folly of their husbands and said we will feed krishna now they all took chakra pongal lemon rice coconut rice akkara dishil and your your tamarind rice the different rices and different vyanjana what not they took everything and they filled their pots with everything they started carrying their pots they were moving towards krishna it was 1 1 pm he was quite hungry we started shivering right we shiver and we become suddenly nervous bhagavan started shivering he became nervous he started moving he looked at all those girls slowly they were moving towards him verth pachith vai rashind vendadisil unnum bodu idennu paathirundu nadu nokkukkollum patta vilosanathu kennai uithidumin alvar says andal sings this verth he started sweating pachith he was too hungry vai rashind he started shivering verth pachith vai rashind vendadisil unnum bodu idennu paathirundu whether it's coming in time or not here is krishna who expects us to feed him he is the one who feeds this entire universe annam bahukurvita annanna nindyat annanna parichakshita annam brahme divya janat anna devakal vimani bhutani jayante annena jatani jivanti annam prayanta bisam bisanti iti tad vignaya punareva varunam pitaram upasasara the upanishad says he is annadata he is the creator he is the cultivator he is the bestower when shastra confirms that bhagavan is everything here is he who expects us to feed him and this happened when he was in a vibhava avatara stage as krishna avatara but when krishna is now in an archa form in a deity form certainly he expects us to feed him that's very very important so at home you have to do puja every day offer to him and then only have food it is very important that you ensure that to your kids too even to your children they may go to school at 7 am 6:30 or 7:30 ensure that at least you offer fruits dry fruits or milk and give that prasadam to them if you don't do that krishna tells in bhagavad gita yagya shishtashina santah muchyante sarva kilbishaihi te tvagam bunjate papaha ye pachanti atma karanat those who cook for themselves and eat without offering it to me or eating balls of papam they are not having morsels of rice they are only having bits and pieces of papam why should we do that here is krishna who was expecting the wives to come they all appeared they offered to krishna they were quite happy krishna blessed them and for their sake blessed their husbands too this is known as yagya patni anugraham we must also know if you are doing tapas or doing japam if suddenly bhagavan appears before you 
and tells you to serve him don't tell him foolishly that my japam is yet to be over i had committed 108 i have done 88 wait for 20 more rounds i will finish and look at you so bhagavan anugraham he blessed the yajna patnis then we move on to the next govardhana uddharana charitra indra makha bhanga this was when krishna was established as the savior as the protector of this universe bhagavan is a rakshaka there is a shloka which says that lakshmi asaha rishikeshah devya karunya rupaya rakshak sarvasiddhante vedante picha giyate bhagavan is sung as he is glorified as the rakshak sarvasiddhante and as he protect alone no he protects along with with the company of mahalakshmi he protects us all where did he protect what happened there was a annual festival that was customary in gokula the festival was they cooked about 108 kilos of rice or even at times 1008 kilos of rice not only rice adik vendiya kariyamudu kolambamudu shaatamudu masha poopam guda poopam lot of curd lot of ghee used to be loaded in a chariot loaded in a big wheeled vehicle that was taken to a place in a big maidan and they offered to indra indra would never visit he would just accept whatever being offered to him this is an annual practice anna kuta utsavam this is being done even in temples today anna prasadam kuta is collected like a mountain anna kuta utsavam the mountain of prasadam is offered krishna had gone outside of gokulam for couple of days he returned and he suddenly saw there were preparations being made for this festival what is happening i never knew that there is a festival like this who are you going to do aradhan they all quickly replied it is to indra this is an annual festival we are going ahead with that krishna objected no i won't agree what is indra doing for us he does nothing for us he, st- he started talking like an atheist don't offer puja to devas don't offer anything to them what do they give us it is only the physical mountain govardhana that helps us whatever rain you get because of govardhan all your wood and furniture because of govardhan where do they get herbs from mulihai from because of govardhan how do you get your uh, cows to graze because of govardhan where do you get all your fruits and trees as from govardhan so everything is govardhan govardhan is a big mountain in brindavan close to brindavan it's about 20 22 kilometers from brindavan a beautiful place that govardhana parvata mountain was chosen by krishna to establish himself as the protector he said this year we will change the custom i am a reformer i am a very social reformer this year i am reforming no more puja to this indra from this year it will be to govardhana the whole village divided into two all the elders were in one side all the youth were in the other side problem began so all the the elders yielded they accepted this year let us try offering to govardhana and they invited trouble indra thought they are denying me of my customary food i must teach them a lesson he called for a, a big flock of the clouds he called ordered the clouds to go stop above brindavan gokul and shower shower and shower rains ensure that there is flood all flood throughout gokul and brindavan yes the execution the, the order was carried out by the clouds varuna deva obeyed to the order and now they all realized we had made a mistake our mistake is we should not have irritated indra what to do now but the children were quite happy they were confident that we have done no mistake we all know that krishna will protect us ho oh, krishna can you protect before even the gopakumaras could feel the pain krishna immediately came to their rescue he said now let us first finish the offering is it not right that you put a curtain when you offer prasadam to perumal you can't do it in open we have to make a curtain and hide it must be in secrecy now how to do the boy says this is a mountain how are we to put a curtain here don't put a curtain close your eyes that's a curtain all boys close their eyes krishna immediately resolved aham govardhana asmi i am govardhana he took the form of govardhana and consumed all food in a minute he consumed and told this boys open your eyes have you any day seen indra having food so quickly have you any day seen that and have is he any day had food he had only left food for you this is the first time someone has had food so this is when they are happy about your offering 
all other years they were not happy in your offering that's why they returned the food to you and this is the first time they are happy about this offering good that govardhana has had it now the same govardhana is going to protect you don't think that i am going to protect you i told you that govardhana is our helper i will prove that govardhana would help you now saying so krishna slowly lifted the mountain attuk vishottu parupadam tayirvaviyam nellalalum atta potta chutti unnavanavar konukku aayar urupadutta adichal undadum vannamal varai eduthu malai kaathadum unnavanavar konukku aayar urupadutta adichal undadum vanavar konu sindra now he was denied of his food he was furious he started raining krishna slowly lifted this govardhana he didn't move he didn't shiver and he didn't look painful at all on his right finger he lifted i am saptahayano balaha how old was krishna then just 7 years old shola shur kunnaduttai sollu tirumangalvar says meinira kelpuha maapurala this namalvas pasha meinira kelpuha maapurala shuna vainira neer peliri choriya ina anira paadi ange odunga appan thimalai gaattu kunnam eduttane புயலொரு வரமழை பொழிதர மணிநீரை வயலொரு நடுவரை எடுவியா நெடியவர் திருமங்கியாழ்வ ஆல்சோ கன்ஃபார்ம்ஸ் நோ கிருஷ்ணா வாஸ் ஹோல்டிங் திஸ் மவுண்டன் ஹி லுக் டு சோ பியூட்டிஃபுல் இன் இஸ் திருபங்கி ஃபார்ம் ஹி வாஸ் ஹோல்டிங் இன் இஸ் ரைட் ஃபிங்கர் அண்ட் தட் ஃபிங்கர் டிட் நாட் ஈவன் பெயின் இட் டிட் நாட் டர்ன் ரெட்டிஷ் இட் ஹெல்ட் இட் சோ பியூட்டிஃபுல்லி அண்ட் கிருஷ்ணா வாஸ் ஸ்டாண்டிங் இன் இஸ் திருபங்கி பாஸ்டர் ஆல் த பாய்ஸ் வேர் குவைட் ஹாப்பி தென் டே claim to their elders did we not tell you that krishna will protect us at any cost he has done it now and protected through what the same govardhana he told that govardhana would help us he has proved that govardhana had helped us more than govardhana it is krishna who helped us now suddenly one boy yelled he said krishna we have never seen any seven year old boy lifting a mountain now that you have done i have a doubt i am suspicious that you may be a deva or an asura or a rakshasa or a gandharva who are you are you one amongst us or are you a different clan who are you krishna was quite angry on him are you going to accept me one amongst you if so i will hold this mountain <laughs> if you distance me from you i'll put down the mountain aham vo bandhavo jatah i am one of you naham gandharva na yaksha na cha rakshasa na asura aham vo bandhavo jatah i have come here that you are all my relatives i know that you are quite intimate to me then why are you distancing me don't do that let me all be one let me all be together so krishna lifted the mountain protected the gokulan finally indra realized his folly came and fell in the lotus feet of krishna and he was pardoned that is govardhana dharana anru ivalahamalandai adibhoti chennangu tennelanga shattai teral porti ponna chakada mudaitai pohal porti கண்ணு குணிலா விரிந்தாய் கடல் போற்றி குன்று குடையா வெடுத்தாய் குணம் போற்றி ஆண்டாள் ஆஃபர்ஸ் மங்களாசாசனம் ஸ்ரீ கிருஷ்ணா குன்று குடையா விடுத்தாய் குணம் போற்றி தட் வாஸ் த கிரேட் நோபல் குவாலிட்டி ஆஃப் கிருஷ்ணா தட் இ பார்ட் அண்ட் இந்திரா த மொமெண்ட் ஹி ஃபெல்ட் சாரி ஃபார் இஸ் டீட் கஷாமிய ஹோ தத் அபிசந்தி விராம மாத்திராத்